I'm trying to poach an egg. We're in Florida for a water polo tournament. Yeah. And you just want to and see what tastes like. We decided uh, to have Oreos for dinner. Okay, it's the end of the day when she said, oh, there's Katie Elizabeth. She's uh, cleaned up the dishes. That's a good thing, and now she's making a breakfast. Katie, what do you have going here? I'm trying to poach an egg. <laughs> <laughs> and how's it going so far? Well, I haven't, like, poached it yet, but I have it in my bowl now. <laughs> so. Right, so she's um, got an app here to show her how to poach an egg. She's got a boiling water. It's not even an app, it's just a random video that I found. Look at that. Hold I up, I need to, I need to take a video for my weekend vlog. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> Alright, so, um, you put the egg in a bowl? <clears throat> Did you put it in the water? Did you put it in your toast? Yes. But it needs to cook for three minutes before it goes in my toast. Have you ever done this before? I have not, but I just watched the video, so I'm pretty experienced. Huh. So I don't think that's what it's supposed to look like. <laughs> What's happening? But now I'm going to set the kitchen timer for three minutes. Okay. Oh, hold up. Hey. Is it hold up. Oh, what? Oh, shoot. It's that's kind of good, hey. low key. Kind of bubbling. On the low. I'm going to turn it down, down a little bit. No, that's fine, right? I guess. All right. I'm not a, I know nothing about egg poaching. Me neither. Ryan, you in? I don't want to yes, I don't know. If, I don't know what to say. Okay, move over. I gotta start cooking my toast. All right. Cook it with gas, as they say. Yep. Uh, tell me when it's done, and I'll come out. I'm so good at everything. Let's see. I'm hey, literally kidding. No, right. that was a. Uh... <laughs> oh, uh -oh, bro! <laughs> so I can literally, I can literally <laughs> end him in like three seconds. <laughs> All right, good luck, <laughs> everybody. so little. <laughs> it's like a little bird pecker. <laughs> <laughs>
No. <laughs> It is, sorry, we are at the water polo tournament and we are looking at the brackets right now. It looks like we have finished first in our bracket and now we get to play because we won the game this morning and two games yesterday and now we're going to play for third, we think. Yes, I guess we are playing for third. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, yeah. We're playing for third. Very exciting. All right, you guys, now we came to lunch. You know, if we didn't tell you before, we're in Florida for a water polo tournament and we're having a great time. We have day two of the tournament. We had a game this morning. The boys won. And now we are out to lunch and they are totally ready to chow. So Brennan ordered the craziest thing. I've never seen this on the menu before. It is a hamburger. I bet this is what Guy Fieri got. I bet it is. Yes, Guy Fieri has been here. I've, it's a hamburger in between two grilled cheese sandwiches with bacon and egg. So hold on one second. Let me turn the camera around. Alright, you guys. There's everybody. There's Alistair. Hello, Alistair. Alistair, you a great game today, buddy. Nice work. Absolutely. What'd you get, Alistair? I, think it's done. I got a fried chicken sandwich. That looks pretty good. And when the lady brought it out, she called it a chicken nugget sandwich, which I've never had before in my life. Uh, oh my gosh. Liam, you got chicken and waffles. For sure. That looks fantastic. Is that strawberry to. butter? Uh, yeah, I think so. Nice. Oh my gosh, Drew, that looks Trip, wicked good too. Oh yeah. Just chicken, <laughs> chicken nuggets, chicken tenders. Chicken tenders, yeah. chicken tenders are huge and beautiful. We got some salads and avocado toast from all the healthy parents. Nice job, Mike. Nice job. Well, that's my avocado toast. Oh wait. <laughs> and you guys taking your beer, Brennan, can you please explain what you have? So, starting with the top layer, obviously we have a classic grilled cheese, but contrary to what you might think, it's a double grilled cheese separated by the patty in the middle. It's going to go patty, bacon, tomato, One by everybody cheese. Oh my gosh. And you get the patty down there, and then it's reciprocated on the bottom. So you see that you have the double grilled cheeses, boom, burger, double grilled cheese. So, you know, I'm really saying to you, just want to chow it and see what tastes like. <laughs> He's going to sink to the bottom of the pool, I think. All right, let's see. All right, Frankie, uh, <laughs> we're here, uh, we're here, uh, No, this is a big, it's a lot of food, no? I might sink in the pool, I don't really care. One bite, everyone has rules. <laughs> Break it down for us. A lot of flavor in there. You get a lot with one bite. <laughs> it's going to be a score. It's going to have to be an 8.3. 8.3! 8 8 3. 8 3. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're back. Trip, what'd you get, Trip? Chicken and waffles. Oh my gosh, can you please give us a little tour of what that plate is? <laughs> well, we got some strawberry butter and then a whole chicken. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. And how about you? What'd you get there, Hunter? Uh, I got some cinnamon pancakes. Okay. So it's just pancakes with cinnamon butter and a little bit of cinnamon. You might need to get more food than that. I might. I don't know. It's like, it like five bucks. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we have another group of people over here. All right, do you order yet? No. Okay, you might want to take a little tour. It's crazy. They did a chicken and waffles. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, it's our other team over here. Not our other team, our other table of our team. Our other table of our team. All right, you guys, rate your, rate your trip so far on a scale of one to ten. Uh, nine. Nine, fantastic. 9.5. <laughs> uh, 9.5. Sweet! I don't know, the rain is putting a damper for a It's always sunny and be grayer because then we could get tan. That's true, because when we're in Florida, we want to get tan. Exactly. I know, I know, but thank you, Florida. Thank you, Florida. You've been awesome to us. <laughs> Brendan finished his water polo tournament and we made it to Fort Lauderdale Beach. Wait, let's turn around so we can get the beach in the back. It's a beautiful beach. It was a beautiful night in Fort Lauderdale. It is gorgeous. We just saw four, did you see all four cruise ships go by? Four cruise ships went out, which is like our favorite. She and loves cruise ships. I do love cruise ships. And there's one other one that's gonna come out and I'm keeping my eyes on. So anyway, so Brendan's been hanging out with his buddies. We're and I beach. and I've been hanging out with, with his, with Liam's mom, but so we've been in She's not a big fan of Liam's mom, actually. I'm really a huge fan, like, except we don't get along at all. We've been having a blast. It's so much fun. So, um, all right, so we're going to um, take them to the airport. Oh, hello. Hold on. This is oh, Brandon has got something. Oh, hey, great. Oh, yeah. We're going to take them to the airport because they're flying home tonight, but Brendan and I are staying one more night, and so we'll check in with you guys later. I hope you're having a good time at home, and I miss them. 
Hi, Katie. Hi, Katie. She says hi. Hi. Okay, bye. Okay, Ryan and I are a little hungry, and uh, he just said, hey, we need some grub. So we decided uh, to have Oreos for dinner. Thankfully, Mom uh, bought some good Oreos. So these are, like, check this out. There's the regular Oreos. Pretty cool. Mm -hmm. There's the double stuff Oreos. Very good. And then there's the most stuff. Boom! So let's take a look. Did you give us this? Here's a regular. I didn't think so. Regular one, right? That's good. I like that. Boom, boom. Let's see which one's that. And then, try the most stuff. You want one? Yeah, I wonder what this is like. <laughs> look at how oh my stuffed gosh. that is. That is <laughs> we got redonkulous. Oh, look, look at that. Mm -hmm. You know, that's trash. That's insane. It is insane. And, but, but Dad, read that right there. Taste test? Yep. Read that right there. Milk's favorite cookie. Boom. You gotta have milk. I mean, come on. You, you just have to. I love it. I think it's a lot. All right, let's try them out. All right, let's go. All right, let's try it. Should I try the most stuff first? Uh, uh, we should, we should just, we should both, uh, get what's called the, wait, can I have the back? Hmm. It's called the level, or what's it called? The the something um in like science when you're doing experiments uh, no, the no, constant no, the constant or whatever oh so this just is just a, take the take the okay. regular first this is just your regular mm -hmm, mm -hmm, oreo mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. oh good mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. classic mm -hmm. i would say very good <laughs> can I understand why they're milk's best friend uh-huh okay Here's your double stuffed. Thank you. Mm. <laughs> double stuffed means double the milk. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We're just trying to get the camera mm -hmm. center. What's that? Well, that. just stand like this. That. Just go like this. <laughs> <laughs> just double? That's the double stuffed. Yeah, that's good too. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Double stuff. Mm -hmm. oh. mm. Although, I think I have to go to the, the original so far. Mm. Mm. You know what they should do? Mm. Keep the frosting the same, but do like double chocolate. Mm. It's like more of the chocolate. Than the double? By the way, we could be, we could definitely be. The marketing marketing executives for Oreo. Totally. Hey Oreo. Look at, look at that. Give us a ring. Nabisco. Mm hmm Which is short for the biscuit company, the National Biscuit Company. Did you know that? Hmm. Huh. Nabisco. National Biscuit. Like that, that's a the thing. biscuit company and then it was right. co was company. company. So Nabisco. Right. The biscuit company. Hmm. There you go. Cool. So give us a call, Ryan, Daddy O. Ryan Dad. We're in. Let's see. We'll come you know, in. We'll come in. We'll give you some ideas. Sure. We'll pitch you our ideas. Mm -hmm. We'll run a commercial. We're we'll right. great with that. Put a little tuna in here. Mm-hmm. Tuna? What'd you... I don't know. A lot no, of okay. box thinking. So, so, Oreo, you don't have to hire <laughs> him. You just take me. It's half the price. <laughs> oh, mm -hmm. oh, wow. Mm -hmm. A whole thing just collapsed. Mm-hmm. Which is a problem. It is a problem, but it's stayed in one piece, kind of. Yeah. Well, I mean, it, nothing fell on the ground. I guess it depends. You shouldn't talk with your mouthful. Uh -huh. If you like the outside, you're gonna like the regular. Uh -huh. If you like the middle more, you'll like double stuff or the most stuff. Uh -huh. Definitely. I'm thinking maybe we mess around with the outside. Uh -huh. Maybe we make it. I don't know. Oreo. Salmon. Come to us. Oh no! Make you know what? Salmon. Salmon no, outside. Sa no. I love salmon. I love Oreos. They just mm. don't mix. Mm. Um, so I don't like this. Yeah. Yeah. No, you know what there is, though? Mm. Oreo thins. Now we're talking. Which is my kind of thing. Now, see, they're, they're being creative now. Not That's why they need us. Mm -hmm. Not sponsored by Oreo, by the way. I know it looks like it. Nabisco, salmon Oreos. That's the way to go. Mm. All right, which one do you like? See, now the viewers are disgusted. Now they're like, ew, <laughs> now I got that in my head. <laughs> I'm gonna oh. go with regular Oreos. I'm gonna go with regular Oreos. 
If we had Oreo Thins here, though, I'd go with Oreo Thins. Totally. All right. Comment below on your favorite Oreo or your favorite Oreo flavor. Uh huh. You like the inside or the outside? So it better be the outside. Boom. See you guys. That was fun. Mm -hmm. We had an incredibly amazing day. Holy cow. It doesn't seem as though it was only like 12 hours ago that we woke up. It was a huge day. Today was the last day of Brennan's water polo tournament. I thought they played an amazing game. Um, I don't know if the boys felt that they played amazingly, but I think they did. Um, and I am super, super proud of them. They had a tournament finished higher than they've ever finished before. We've been in this tournament three years in a row, which is awesome. I'm so proud of them. They won their first four games and lost their last two, or won their first one, two, three, won the first three games and lost their last two. Finished in fourth in the whole tournament. So um, we lost to Barcelona, Spain, and then we lost to a team in Florida, South Florida. So anyway, um, we did that, and then we went to lunch, and then we went to the beach, and Nan and Pat were here, and I'm so sorry I didn't video Nan and Pat. They came over to watch Brennan's game, um, but it rained. Uh, part of the reason why I think I probably didn't film is it rained incessantly throughout the whole game. Was that fun, playing in the rain, Brennan? Yeah. Um, and then after we went to lunch, then we came over, we went to the beach. Um, you saw a little bit of us at the beach, and then Brennan and I, Came over here, um, we're staying in a hotel, and then tomorrow morning we will fly out and go back home. So. Uh, what made me happy today was 100% seeing Nan and Pap and watching Brennan play polo. It, I've said it before and I'll say it again, one of my most favorite things in the whole wide world. So I am just so happy that, um, to have been on this trip and had the opportunity to hang out with the other parents and the other players and just be supporting and encouraging and watch all the water polo because I love it. Brennan, what made you happy today, buddy? I'm going to say seeing an impact. All right, you guys. So we are going to call it a night. We are watching an amazing, I know I've used the word amazing a lot. Okay, let me change my word. We are watching a very informative, very interesting show on the History Channel called Washington. It's all about George Washington. He's and he is to he's totally a homie. If you know, you know. And um, he is... <laughs> if you're American, you know. And he's talking about... Well, what we found out was... But apparently our friends in England don't realize that we used to be a part of you guys and we fought for our independence and now we're our own country. So um, we still love you, England. It's all good. Mm. Yes, we do. Still kind of beefing. Still kind of beefing. Um, anyway, so it's oh, it's back on, back on. We gotta go. Anyway, this is an amazing special about George Washington. If you're interested in history, you should totally watch it on the History Channel. And we've been watching it for about an hour and a half now. Okay, bye. Hey, comment below. <laughs> so I can't see that. Comment down below. It made you guys happy today. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.